I'm not a vampire, not an alien, I'm not the fucking mummy, I'm a goblin. Greetings, Goblin Nation! Welcome to my review of Venom, uh, the complete series by Daniel Wayne. I didn't want to do this! I actually bought, uh, uh, bought me the wrong comic. I didn't want to do this comic. I thought it was one Donny Cage. I'm almost like. I thought it was that wrong, but that was actually before I actually know the writer, before I actually d uh, know the difference. Well, the, the good one is gonna come. This one is from Daniel Wayne and uh, uh, the whole collection kind of thing. Is it good? I mean, the story, actually, the reading, writing itself <coughs> was not too bad. I, I'm a, one of those guys, I always give it a doubt kind of thing. But the art style, it's like doesn't fit with what it is kind of thing i feel like the art style is not what i wanted for an, in the beginning it feels like a horror kind of thing a horror thing that i'm like oh, that's cool that's, that's cool but the art style is so cartoonish very cartoonish you can see it kind of thing and, uh, the characters how they look and uh it has the story about uh and soldiers but they don't look like soldiers she, this are like this she's the soldier kind of thing uh she doesn't look as much like i can i cannot see the difference sometimes between soldiers and not soldiers and just sin and that kind of thing they all look funny she apparently is a soldier we have also this agent <coughs> that's apparently made by the fantastic four on some point and this kind of thing uh we get wolverine uh, coming in wolverine ca gets into the story and even though Wolverine himself doesn't look half as bad, I mean, uh, it's Wolverine, he still looks menacing uh, kind of thing. But there is all like robots involved uh, that cannot, that symbiotes cannot wear. And this is why the symbiotes like, you know what? I go from host and host eating them all alive. I gotta kill them all till I go to the next body. That's what I do kind of thing. And I feel like. Uh, then there is this cyborg kind of going on thing, <coughs> all those kind of things. It does just. I tried to give it a try. I tried to keep reading it, and I did too for the most part. It's at the ending after the uh, fantastic, even the Fantastic Four. God damn it, man! They look so weird. They look so. I don't like it. I really don't like the way they look. Uh, the comics kind of thing. Uh, all those things. It's just the art style that keeps me away of the kind of things th that's uh, written here. Uh, and certainly because it feels like it needs to be a horror kind of thing, but it doesn't. Uh, it just feels so awfully irritating. I just have so many, many things about it that I hate. Uh, uh, mostly the two things. The story is decent. The art style, I mean, if you like that cartooning thing, good for you. But I feel I really don't like it. I don't really, I don't give, I'm, I'm, I'm a, I don't give too much reviews uh, that are like very low. But this one, and I, I paid the thirty bucks for it, so I kind of, uh, I kind of see this. This is great looking, but doesn't uh, doesn't matter. Doesn't really matter. I don't even know if this is even Venom. There are like play hard kind of thing. Now there are two. I didn't even read this far. No, there is Venom and there is Co uh, there is Venom and Spider-Man against each other at the ending. But I really, really not that much interested in the uh, in the story anymore. It's a very forgettable story. It's also the reason why I think I misbought me so because I didn't kind of uh, pay enough attention to the kind of thing. But I, I tried to give it a try. I tried to read it as much as I could. And uh, I gotta say, it's not a good guy. It's 30 bucks for the whole fucking collection. And that meant like, oh, this was, this was bad. I know there is some good stories like Donny Kane. Kate, uh, he done a cool awesome story that I actually wanted and I'm really gonna think but uh, so yeah I wanted to give some worth of my money so I'm doing a review seems like a good thing well Goblin Nation I give this one uh, a zero
I mean, I go to the kind of thing. It's going into the trash, into the negative zone. Get it? Negative. It's negative. What? Uh, lower than uh, zero kind of thing. I don't like it. I don't. I don't do buy actually collection kind of thing that much. I don't buy the kind of things, uh, physical copies so much because I am like. Uh, I like the villain kind of stories. I like those time to, those are stories most of the time I'm like I cannot miss by myself. I cannot I love those stories Deadpool sure Go Cosmic Ghost Rider awesome the event of uh, black uh, metal I'm a fucking metal fan how and I'm a comic fan this is made for me man Scott Snyder has done a great job with the kind of thing those are comics I really love but this one this is the first time I miss bought me myself so hardcore I never had that so this this goes to the negative zone yes this is the first and last time I'm gonna give, give something negative uh, or under uh, zero that's how bad I feel like it is I mean it's mostly uh, maybe somebody's out style but this is not the style I want to see in my comics this this is so weird it's not even fun to read that much and I don't have that uh, scenario that much. It's very, very low grade kind of thing. I would not recommend it, but you know, everybody has their taste. Everybody has this taste. I want to taste this. Ah, and it tastes awful. But I want to burn it. That would be something. Oh, you know, burn it, throw it at somebody. Maybe that's what it's good for. What is it good for? To burn it to the ground. To, to burn the whole village down. Now that's something I can use it for. Anyway, that's my review on Venom, the complete collection by Daniel Wayne kind of thing. What do you guys think? You guys think I'm fucking wrong? That this goblin that you've been following, this goblin is wrong. I mean, we're a goblin nation. We don't, we're a nation. We can have all our own opinion about things. If you like the art style, the beautiful cartoonish art style, because it is pretty, but to look at. Kind of thing, but in the story wise and in everything, that kind of thing, the whole story, the whole con, like what it should be. I don't think it fits so well, don't fit at all. It's cool to see a picture of it or to or just go through it like this. That's uh, that's about it. Where my curiosity ends to just like, ah, nice, okay, I've seen it, I don't want to see it again. I want to burn it, burn it to the ground. Anyway, I got that already. Anyway, so what do you guys think of it? Let me know down below and I hope to see you Goblin Nation. This was Twisted Goblin and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. Good night. I do it all because I'm evil and I do it all for free. Your tears are all the